Hello Sagittarius, how are you? Welcome to my channel Star 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 and welcome to your reading. So Sagittarius, this is your reading for the month of uh, uh, July. This is still 15th of July. This is a general reading. Take what resonates and leave what does in energies might be vice versa and time is fluid. In this reading, we'll see what you need to know regarding your love life. What you need to know regarding your uh your career your work the general messages overall energy and at the fag end i'll pull out some romantic messages there is an extended reading for this one link for the same is in description box and comment section all right so let's get started now page of cups someone is interested in you but this person will start off as they might start off as friends with you okay i'm getting uh, a very similar energy for all the fire signs like whoever is interested in you they are starting off very cautiously okay i think so people fear fire sign people people fear the the responses that might come from fire sign people that's what i'm getting and that's uh, what I feel over here is uh, it's very likely that the person, whoever this person is interested in you, they really want to make things work out with you. Okay. So that is why this person is acting very cautious, approaching very cautiously uh, towards you. They are starting off with the most conventional way uh, of becoming a friend and then once they start to know you well then this person will think of, of you as a romantic person right uh, or they will approach towards you as a romantic person so that's what i see uh, for some of you sagittarius if this is anyone from the past um i think so if this is an ex your ex probably wants they, they want to become friends with you. You might have rejected this ex in the past. Uh, I mean, you might have dismissed uh, this uh, the comeback of this ex in the past. Okay, and they're trying to come back again. And they are like, okay, at least let's be friends. I don't want to lose you um, permanently from my life. Okay, I want you as my friend. I want to be with you. If not a romantic partner, at least entertain me as your friend. <clears throat> Then we have High Priestess. Um, high Priestess is telling me that people are trying to connect with you with you energetically. For some of you, I'm getting that you do have some obsessive lovers, Sagittarius. Okay? Like there are some obsessive lovers who really want to um, have that crazy, obsessive, intense connection with you. And these people, what I'm getting over here is this is... For some of you, I'm also getting that they are trying to create some sort of influence on you by using certain techniques or methodologies. I don't know what kind of techniques they are utilizing, but I do feel like that there is someone who is trying to create an influence on, on you or there is, there is someone who wants you to think about them, okay? And they are trying to do that through something, through some manifestation process or probably for some of you, I'm also getting that someone is using some witchcraft to influence you. Influence you in the sense like they want you to think about them. They want you to uh, think that they are attractive. Whoever this person is, they are trying to play around with your emotions. Uh, emotions are... I'll not say play around. They're trying to influence your thoughts. That's that's what I'm getting, okay? For some of you, this can be your ex as well. Then we have temperance. Temperance is telling me that, see, you do have options, okay? You do have options. you got to listen to your inner core. You have to listen to your, um, um, your, your heart. You have to listen to your soul, what your soul really, really wants. Okay, if there is someone from the past who is trying to influence you using by whatsoever techniques they are using, okay, uh, if, but still you can, that doesn't mean that you lose um, your, your contact with your soul or you stop 
uh, understanding how your soul, how your mind and how your heart feels or what your body is trying to tell you. Okay, be, be, understand what exactly do you want. If someone is trying to get in touch with you energetically, if someone is trying to play around with your energy, okay, uh, you have to understand that. And that, that is also another message through high priestess. Like, uh, like you have to be alert. Your higher self will try to tell you something. I'm again, I'm feeling like whoever is trying to influence you they are not here to harm you they just want you to think about them in a positive manner okay and then we on one hand we have this person on another hand we have another person so over here i do see you do have options sagittarius on another hand uh we have a person who will try to bring that balance in your life who will try to uh fill up the void that you have okay you have that void of loving and caring partner in your life and their intentions is to fill up that void their intentions is to love you to take care of you okay and uh, they don't want you to feel like your life is devoid of any kind of love for some of you i'm also getting that uh if you if you if you do not share a good connection or a good relationship with your family members this person will also try to fulfill that void okay in fact i'm feeling like whoever this another person is they will try to establish very good connections with your family members and they will try to streamline the relationship your relationship and your uh, your family members relationship i mean streamline things between both of you this person wants to go above and beyond to prove themselves. That's what I'm getting. And they really care for you. Whoever the second person is, what kind of the feeling that I'm getting from this person is that they really and genuinely care for you. So you do have options. It's time for you to, I mean, it's up to you. You have to think about uh, which one is right for me. Okay. Uh, as far as your overall energy is concerned, we have the sun. Sun card is telling me that your overall energy is looking very positive. You are coming across as that happy-go-lucky person. Okay, uh, not stressing yourself out with uh, with anything much. Okay, it'll be like whatever happens, let's see. And uh, uh, I'll handle the situation as it comes. I'm not going to stress myself about anything or anyone. And uh, I have courage and I have the protection uh, which will help me to deal with any kind of a situation. Uh, having said so, it doesn't mean that I have to worry. Uh, you know, I, I, I need to constantly worry about anything. No, I am here to feel happy. I'm here to enjoy my life and I'm going to do that. So you have a very, very positive approach, Sagittarius, and keep this approach throughout your life. This will really, really help you. In fact, such kind of approach also helps warding off any kind of negative energy. Okay. Ten of Cups. As far as your career is concerned, we have Ten of Cups. Ten of Cups is telling me, Sagittarius, that you... Uh, Partnerships are proving out to be very fruitful, very, very fruitful. The results that you will see through these partnerships, work-related partnerships, those results will be outstanding. I also feel like you're going to create something with someone. Uh, you, might, you might get into a startup or you might start a new business or a side hustle with someone. But I think so you and someone else, both of you, gel together very well as far as your career related aspirations are concerned as far as career related ambitions and uh, thoughts are concerned maybe you might even have similar educational backgrounds but i do feel like you either you're going to meet someone uh, with whom you'll get along very well and both of you might start thinking about uh, what should be doing what we should be doing in the future or if you are already in some sort of partnership, collaborations, if you're a part of some kind of a team, you will find that it's working with a team, working with this partner is not just fun, but also really productive. Okay. Then we have Knight of Swords. Knight of Swords is telling me that uh, you have to be careful from people who are 
jealous of you who doesn't want good things to happen to you um you are under see i i do feel sagittarius that there are people un, around you who are actually backstabbers they show something else on your face but the moment you turn your back they 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 think something else about you okay you do have backstabbers in and around you so you have to be careful let's talk about the romantic messages let's talk about the romantic messages you are such a kind human being you are such a kind human being uh you bring a smile to my face every morning i feel halved when i'm not with you you keep little mementos of things we have done you are the one that comes to mind when i look up at the beautiful stars you love unconditionally even when you're angry or gloomy you are still adorable beautiful i saw love in love in you hold me like you never want me to go i learn something new from you every day all right i hope this resonates hit like share and subscribe comment down below link for the extended is in description box and comment section in the extended we'll see what your person truly thinks and feels about you an action they will take towards you and likely conclusion between you and this person all right take care have a great time and bye bye